name's Big Steve. We'll punch somebody. Out. I have an Emmerich fighting out of Sterling, Colorado and Garcia Sports. Uh, here to put on a good show and take home that title. I'd like to thank my beautiful wife and my sponsor, uh, The Snowhopper. Ladies and gentlemen, making his way to the cage, fighting out of the Spartan Labs blue corner, please welcome the challenger, Ivan Emrek. And his opponent making his way to the cage, fighting out of the Spartan Labs blue corner. Excuse me, fighting out of the Ugly Dog Sports Cafe red corner. <laughs> Give it up for your current Sparta Combat League heavyweight title holder, Big Steve Pop Rocky. <laughs> Well, I am sick of hearing all the shit you talk. 
This fight is presented by The Ranch Restaurant. Be sure to like them on Facebook, located at 714th 6th Street in Greeley. And now, fighting out of the Spartan Labs blue corner, this fighter is representing Garcia Sports, weighing in at 262 pounds, fighting out of Sterling, Colorado. Give it up for Ivan Emrick. And his opponent, fighting out of the Ugly Dog Sports Cafe red corner, this fighter is representing Cereal Box, weighing in at 240.8 pounds, fighting out of Denver, Colorado, and the current Sparta Combat League heavyweight title holder, Big Steve Pop Rocky! Gentlemen, elimination title bout. No elbows at any time. Watch your knees when you're on the ground. All right, gentlemen. Blue corner, any questions? Red corner, any questions? All right, gentlemen, let's get ready. Here we go, fight fans. Heavyweight Sparta Combat League Phenom's title bout on the line. In the white trunks, we have our current champion, Mr. Stephen Pop Rocky, facing off against the challenger in the green trunks. Ivan Emmerich. Mr. Ivan Emmerich representing Garcia Sports. Steve Paparaki represents Team Serial Box, recently a Bang Ludwig Muay Thai training affiliate. That's right. Big Steve, the current title holder here. Um, obviously, he's faced some guys that, um, you know, he's beaten them, and, and I think that really. This should be a, a, a nice little test to see how uh, Stevens progressed. One of the few times that I've seen Pop Rocky in the cage with a guy that seems to be bigger than him. Very good point. So Ivan looking to come in with maybe a little bit of a strength advantage, definitely a size and length advantage. See if Pop Rocky is able to get inside on that, utilize his own strength. Nice kick. Big leg kick. Uh, definitely off balance to Ivan a little bit. I guess training with uh, Ben Schistler and Dynamite Diana Real has uh, paid off. Those are some nice leg kicks we haven't really seen before from Steven. Pap Rocky. And, and they're calling for Pop Rocky to throw that right kick again. It had done some damage on Mr. Emmerich. Emmerich keeping his guard nice and high. Agreed. Emmerich showed strength there for a second. Pop Rocky says, I've got just as much. Shoved him right back. These guys are strong. <laughs> no doubt about it. Good, Good body kicks. kick. Good punches landed there for Pop Rocky. Emmerich seemingly unfazed by them. Uh, he's hurt. He, oh, I, he's hurt. I was wrong. He's taking a couple deep breaths. Yeah. Looked like that might have busted up his nose a little bit because yeah. he started breathing out of his mouth immediately. Yeah, he didn't like that at all. Good leg kick by Pop Rocky. You're right, Ron. He's added that into his game nicely. Pop Rocky controlling the, the pace, the action, the fight from start to finish and looks in great shape right now. Not breathing and, heavy. And Pop Rocky listening to his corner. Benjamin Schistler called for the double jab low kick. That's exactly what he threw. Ivan Emmerich looking uh, pretty tired right now. Gas, very cautious. Yeah, and I was just going to say a little bit hesitant to close the distance with power now. I Almost think, like he doesn't want to get into another real solid exchange. I was going to say, I think that big left hook that Steve caught him with changed the fight. Yeah, he's tasted the power. Now he's a little bit wary of it, knows that he can be hurt. Definitely a bummer when your opponent tags you and you know that they can hurt you with it. Pop Rocky goes high. I'm impressed with this. is the best I've seen Steven look to date. One more time, double jab, low kick, lands for Pop Rocky. Corner men starting to head toward the door because we've got about five seconds left in round number one there. That's the bell. Referee Oscar Martinez given some instructions to each fighter. Not, not exactly sure what was being said, but I'm sure it made sense. <laughs> <laughs> We'd like to thank our sponsor, Rev Consulting. Want to rev up your business but don't know where to start? Be sure to check out Rev Consulting. Pop Rocky refusing to take the stool in between rounds. And I like that too. Yep. As do I. A little bit of a little bit of old school there. <laughs> That's exactly what I was thinking. 
corner <laughs> of Pop Rocky telling him that his opponent's tired. They're saying that they want him to go out and push the pace a little bit. This is actually, to me, this is going to be a test of uh, Emmerich where he stands. Uh, you know, because really when you do, like you mentioned, when you taste some power like that, it's interesting to see how people respond. I want to see if he's got some urgency in this second round. Absolutely. Especially for a title. Emmerich pressuring forward first. Pop Rocky gets off the uppercut in the clinch. Now Pop Rocky able to hurt Emmerich a little bit, pushing him back. Good, pu good punches inside, little dirty boxing yeah. shown by Pop Rocky, and Emmerich just turns, turns away. Around. I got to tell you, JR, I think Emmerich's looking for the door. Yeah, I think if Pop Rocky put together a good flurry here, Emmerich, Emmerich might fold up a little bit. Here come the leg kicks from Pop Rocky and a bang bang. Cross up or duck cross now. Cross duck cross. Cross up or duck cross. Emmerich looking tired. Yeah. Real tired. Oh, goodness. Th this is Pop Rocky's chance, but he's just not doing anything. Pop Rocky. Now he pressures forward, lands a good two-punch combination, but again, he stops afterward. I'm telling you, Emmerich's done. He's looking. He just doesn't want any more of this. That's it. There's it. Turtle that's dog. it. He's got a flurry here, and it's a timeout. It's not the end of the fight. It's a timeout. There was a punch to the back of the head. Shot to the back of the head. Yeah of Emmerich as he was down there. So Paparaki, let's see, don't know if they're gonna uh, give a warning, take a point. It's basically up to the referee's discretion here. See how bad he thinks it was. And that's it, referee. Adam Martinez has waved off the fight, so that's gonna be the end of it. So I think it's going to be a technical knockout victory, although the fight ended on an illegal strike. So we're gonna have to wait till Woody gets up there and gives us the official word because I'm not 100% certain how they're going to call this, Ron. Yeah, I think uh, it seemed that uh, Pap Rocky really hit him with some effective shots, obviously towards the end of that fight, or that round really. And I, and I think earlier what we alluded to both, he just didn't want any more of that. Yeah, I, I, I agree that the fight was over. I don't think that it was an illegal shot that necessarily right. did the damage that stopped the fight exactly. but you and I are not the ones that make those decisions True. so we're going to have to wait until the boxing commission confers and then they will let us know about that True. I think what might happen if you go more than halfway past the second round an illegal shot occurs you're unable to continue the fighter that received the shot is unable to continue they go to the judges scorecards that's how I think it plays out I think you're right And it would appear to me that that's, uh, that's kind of what the Boxing Commission is talking about right now, too. But they're bringing the belt into the cage, so we do have somebody that's going to be the winner of this fight. Woody's up there. We'll take it up to him. He'll give us the official word. All the speculation we just had doesn't matter anymore because now we're going to get to know what really referee is. referee Martinez has called a stop to this fight at 1 minute and 29 seconds into the second round. For your winner, due to TKO... And still, Sparta Combat League heavyweight title holder, Big Steve Pap Rocky. For our fight fans joining us on the Internet Pay-Per-View, we are going to take about a 10-minute intermission now. Thanks for having joined us. I'm here with your winner and still defending Sparta Combat League heavyweight title holder, Steve Paprocki.
Start that interview here, and then we'll be right back after the intermission. Steve, that was a hell of a fight. Your first title defense, how does it feel, bro? Feels like any other fight. Let's go. Who would you like to thank? I want to thank my coaches, Ben Schistler, Diana Rael, my whole team, Cereal Box, Danny Mitchell, MMA Mass Destruction, Greg Stone, Penthouse, Global Productions, Presidential Roofing Restoration, UFC Gym Colorado, Smoky Banana Tattoo, Ilk Corp. Biz, uh, Stacy's Law Office, Mike Searles, my girlfriend Kat, and everybody who came out. I love you guys. Let's go drink. Your heavyweight title holder, Steve Paprocki, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> 